Salisbury Cathedral, one of the gems of early English architecture. Begun and completed in the 13th century, its extreme length is 473 feet. But its most famous feature is the great spire built in the next century, highest in England, stretching up into the blue for 404 feet. Standing proudly through the intervening centuries, this elegant landmark is now in need of urgent repair. A £100,000 appeal for funds is already being translated into action. And the old original winch used nearly 600 years ago by the medieval masons again does the same service. The spire also houses the oak timbers used as scaffolding by the 14th century workmen. For in those days, workmanship and materials were meant to last. The work of restoration involves removal and replacement of the existing cross, capstone and 25 feet of stonework. It's heady work, 404 feet above ground, calling for steady nerves and a cool head. But it's all in the day's work for the steeplejacks on the job. But what about Victorio's cameraman? Much more of this, he says, and there'll have to be a fund to restore him. It's going to be a long job and in bad weather, a tricky one. Still, when the sun shines, there's great compensation in an unsurpassed view of Salisbury and the surrounding country. They won't have to climb up and down each day for three electric lifts will be installed in addition to the ancient winch to speed up delivery of materials to the windy site of operations. The worst is behind them. Erecting the scaffolding strikes us as the most hair-raising job of all. It's a noble spire, a tribute to ancient art and craftsmanship. Now, present-day Englishmen and modern workmanship have their chance to add their contribution to this solid reminder of their country's heritage.